Hello there and welcome to my airspace. I'm here in Oregon Sand Dunes National Park and I'm staying at the Lagoon Campground because Wax Myrtle is closed. Evidently when the rains really get bad and the weather get really bad the campground often gets flooded. Anyway, this is a view from the trail and it's about a mile long trail to get me over there to the edge of that water. That water being the Pacific Ocean and this is the Silt Coos River. And this is a wonderful, wonderful trail. I just love this park and I've never been here at this time of year being Today is October 11th. Last time I was here, it was 4th of July 2019, I believe. So, very different. I'm sure it's going to be. This hike to the water is going to reveal different things to me than it revealed the last time I was here. And out there in this area, which is a pretty protected area, um, it's protected for the snowy plover, but it's the snowy plover per, per protection time is over with. That ends. Uh, mid to late September and usually there's big groups, herds of um, sea lions that position themselves off these beaches and maybe I'll see some of those today and we'll see. Um, very few people are camped here right now. It rained and it rained hard last night. And my camper has a skylight in it. And boy, was that no noisy. Right over my head, like two feet. And it kept me awake and I ended up staying in bed much later than usual. Usually at this time of day, I'd be on my way back from my walk. It's like 9.30. And, or I would be already long back from it. However, I slept in. I just wake when I naturally feel like waking. And it was a good sleep. Okay. So again, Sil Silt Coos River in Oregon Sand Dunes National Park. And I see there are some a few people out there. I'm guessing this is the time the salmon run, I believe. So, I don't know. Do the salmon run up the Silt Coos River? I don't know. I know people kayak on it, and there is fishing on it. So, um, as I always say, make it a wonderful day. It's up to you to do that. It's up to your mind and your heart and who you are. Be self-reliant. Know that the power is within you. Strengthen the power within you. Your own spirit guides within you. The angels that follow you and surround you and are all around you. The angelic beings that protect you. Many people ask me about this adventure that I'm on and being out here in the middle of nowhere so to speak, however, all by myself. And I have my moments of kind of like, oh my God, what the hell am I doing? And I get a little fearful. And for some reason last night, when I got to that campground and I got situated, I had some tough hours. I kept like feeling some strange energy around me that didn't feel good. And... 
I felt like I was going to leave first thing in the morning, even though I'd paid for two nights. And now it's up to debate. I see this spot. And it's so beautiful and wonderful. And I believe I will stay both nights. So I'll get a good time spent here out in nature today. Okay. Go out and pick up some trash. Perform a random act of kindness. Tell someone I love you. Give yourself a hug. Give somebody else a hug. Oh, I think those are otters out there. Yeah, cool. Oh, yeah. I love you. And thank you for subscribing to my channel. Take care. Bye now.